Yeah. My buddy Dad's over there. I'm meeting him out here. We're just meeting up. Good slot red. Yeah, I'll get uh, if I don't catch anything on it today, I'll get another trout for sure. I can probably get the block. Trout. Another the redfish. It's a big trout. It's a redfish. That's a red? Yeah. Oh. It's actually trouty coming across the surface. Yeah, me too. Got another red on. Nice. Another red. This is another slot. Wow, cool. He's got two spots on each side. Really pretty, nice blue tail. Hey everyone. Welcome back to another video. I'm visiting some family in Bradenton for a day or two and uh, brought my two piece seven foot Daiwa rod. Um, kind of just like my makeshift travel rod that I take with me sometimes. So I'm at Robinson's Preserve. 
Gonna see if I can find some snook or some redfish back here. And uh, yeah, we'll see what happens. There we go. Oh no. That was a good snook. There's a bite. How's the snook? There we go. Good old snook. Just a little guy, but... Holy crap. A crab. That's for the shit me. A crab just crawled into my crock. That scared the shit out of me. Oh, that's a good fish. Let's go. I think that's a big snook. He's trying to do. No, come on. Man, bummer. I'm heartbroken right now, guys. That was a really good fish. It sucks to lose something like that. Usually when you go out fishing on a day, you get one shot at one of those big snook like that. So, a little, little bit of a bummer, but I'm gonna keep going and see what I can do. Snooks. I changed over 
I lost my last paddle tail to that ladyfish, so I put on this white zoom fluke on this jig head, and I'm just gonna work it real erratically and have it darting back and forth. First cast with it, got a little snook. Oh, nice. It's a redfish. Nice. On the white fluke. Cool little red. <laughs> 